With Angelique Cosmetics, you can be anyone and have anyone. Yes! What is it? A chrome could use some fine-tuning. Here to serve. Today, the police may
second to upgrade my chrome. Okay, you sit, be comfy, and we will start. Oh. Stay here in camp. I want patrols every half hour, reporting directly to me. Are we preparing for a visit from Biotechnica or a fourth corporate war? Your reference could surprise us at any moment. You're not.
V, you're here. What is she doing here? I forbade you from even breathing on that Militech convoy, so you call in your friend? To do it all behind my back? Is that it? Uh-huh. That's exactly why I had V come and stand right in front of you. Got no fucking clue what's going on here. Damn it to hell, Saul. Are you seriously considering letting that basilisk slip through our fingers? I am. But a chance like this. A chance at what? Rotting up the job we came here to oh, do? Oh, it seems a lot changed while I was away. No. Nothing has changed at all. The Biotechnica people will be here in an hour. Try not to cock anything else up before then. I can't believe it. Look, there he goes, off to paint the grass green. What's this basilisk nonsense? It's an armored Militech cargo panzer. Junk from back in 2060 or so. They want to pedal it off to a backwards country, somewhere it can still pass as a technological wonder. The Militech convoy will take the 101 right past us. Shame not to say hello. This basilisk worth another fight with Saul? Yes, a craft like that would finally put us back on the right path. The family is falling apart. If we fall into this Biotechnica rut, no one will ever take us seriously again. Okay, so you do want to go behind Saul's back. Drag me here specifically for that. Cassidy, Ted, Carol, and Bob also on board. And you plan to grab the Basilisk, how? Thanks, V. Haven't said I'd help just yet. Okay, let's go talk to the rest. Why's everyone got it out for me? So, just the four vets on board with the plan. Nobody else. We didn't bother asking the others. There was too great a risk itself. someone would take it to Saul. Besides, only the vets understand what we have to gain by having a basilisk. Sounds pretty risky to me. On the contrary, easy as pie. There won't even be much security on the convoy. Plus, we'll be doing our part towards furthering the cause of world peace. Why should this beast wind up being used in some little third world skirmish? We'll make better use of it right here in America. Did you try to get Saul on board again? What a damn shame. No luck, huh? Uh, no. What about okay, everyone history? listen. Militech will transport the basilisk okay, in parts so distributed across what two What the hell trucks. else do you have? Wait, do I sense a quiver in your voice? Fuck what you! Whatever, asshole! The convoy and will halt you. at the railroad crossing on the 101. We'll attack from behind, then get the hell out and away. Questions? Comments? Motions? Nice job, Sunshine. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm in. Hmm. Okay. Thanks. First, we'll ride to the station. The train engine we need to block the convoy's way is there. Are you riding with us, or will we meet you there? Riding with you. Excellent. Let's get going. I think I heard a little shake in that voice. You did not. Ah, uh, come on. Did you get your hands clammy, too? Screw you. But, are you sure you didn't leave any tracks? Militech won't notice a thing. Are you trying to insult me, Bobby? Okay, okay. Forget I even asked. Let's go. Nobody's gonna notice you gone back at camp? Saul has no wish to see us there anyway. The better to make a good second impression on the Biotechnica suits. Your sour faces wouldn't help much. Indeed they would not. And the Raffins, what about them? Expecting any trouble? Saul is. He's posted sentries all around the camp. How is that not right? He's wrong in continuing to fight the symptoms rather than the disease. 
Don't miss life in Night City? At times, perhaps. I miss the feeling of having a new beginning. Of freedom. But I also haven't forgotten the emptiness. The feeling of realizing it means nothing if you're alone. Yeah. Took adjustment on my part, too. Though... Never was completely alone. You had someone? A true friend. Jackie by name. You would have liked him, actually. Jackie? I don't remember that. We have arrived. So much, maybe we should just hijack the train. Let the basilisk go on its way. Yeah, then just drive this beast to the 101. There and back. Sol would be on board with that. Are we ready? Okay, the Militech convoy will be traveling from Night City to the base where they're due to meet the buyer. We will stop it at the railroad crossing. All we have to do is shove this beauty in its way. V, any questions? Plan to move this thing how, exactly? It's old tech. Carol will have to hack it. Then I'll somehow have to finagle authorization from the control tower to move it. Tower looks inactive to me, too. Yeah, we'll see to that. You and Pan Am just get the authorization code. Okay. Let's get to work. What are you two doing? I'm finding my inner peace before the storm. While Teddy is just being dead weight. Love to join you. Respect your efforts. Self-respect breeds self-discipline. Once you have both, you have real power. Have fun, kids. Well, hello there. Have you come to make yourself useful? Never seen old tech like this. Know your way around it. How'd you learn? From books? Just wait till you see what's inside the signal tower. They use punch cards. Punch cards! <laughs> Can you believe it? Honestly? Prefer Pan Am to punch cards as a topic of conversation. <laughs> Let me guess. You don't really know why you're here, do you? Pan Am asked me for help. Mm-hmm. She came back to the fold, sweet-talked Mitch and the rest over to her side. But still, she calls you. Interesting, isn't it? off. Saul will be pissed. I can see his face already. How's it going over here? Fantastic. We have everything hooked up, and nothing works. Uh, it works, though not reliably. V, could you scan it? Because I am not open to the prospect of taking it all apart again. Capacitor's damaged. Third from the right. Hmm. Indeed. Hold on. Let me swap it out. Time to try it again. Hey, it works. Thanks, V. Need hand? Of 
course. But in your shoes, I would look for another way in first. I've always been fond of trains, and the stations where so many tracks converge. Hmm. Junctions. Yes, those. When you see them from above, you feel... Free? Like you could set off on a thousand journeys all at once? Perhaps more simply, hopeful. Okay, here we are. Sure thing. Nothing here. Some sort of Stone Age control panel. Let's find the cards first.
But nothing here. Nothing here. Not here. Not here. Nothing here. Nothing here. Hmm. Well, well, well. Got something. Good job. This may sound foolish, because I asked you to help me, but why are you doing this? Because it's important to you. But is that all? I... Sorry, that sounded worse than I intended. Any more questions? No, I know everything I need to, I believe. Perhaps I should send Rogue flowers to thank her for introducing us. Mm, not really your style, don't think. I would add a card. Thank you for giving me a true friend, you manipulative whore. That's my girl. All right, let's rejoin the others. <laughs> 